We are in the home of Steve Zucker in Winnetka, Illinois. A very happy Deion Sanders. The most important thing has already been decided what number he's going to wear. What number is that, Deion? 21. We, got to, we had to get a 2 in there somewhere, so I think we chose a unanimous decision. We wanted 21. You just said this is your mom sitting next to you. You said she's my very rich mom. I don't yeah. think there's any doubt about that. No more sales. No more, no, no more nothing now. We get a big house. We always spend one week. Get everything we want now. Uh, looks like you're wearing your signing bonus here. I mean, uh, you know, plus we have the nice, we can see the nice primetime logo already, or what? Yeah, we got sweatsuit started, jacket started, everything. We got it going on here. Everybody, everybody got on jewelry. Even the baby got a little something. We're ready now. Even the baby has jewelry. Your feelings about going to Atlanta, no doubt it was your first preference. Definitely. Atlanta or Tampa Bay. And uh, Atlanta chose me, and I'm very pleased with that decision. I can't wait to get to town with Coach Campbell and... Uh, Get with them fans down there and pack them in there. When Detroit took the other Sanders, I saw a big grin come across your oh, face. Man. I was so happy. I was going, but I was kind of scared. I thought Detroit was going to take me. I would have asked for so much money that I had to put me on layaway. <laughs> on layaway, uh huh. No baseball's leverage there, huh? <laughs> no. Um, what did Marion Campbell, you just got off the phone with him, what did he say to you on the phone, aside just from welcome to Atlanta? Welcome to Atlanta. He was, you know, he laid low for the last three days and, uh, he knew deep down inside it would work out, and uh, he can't wait to have him get there. And he want oh. Dion and Primetime to get on that plane. Well, what you just said, tell Marion Primetime's coming to Atlanta, huh? I want everybody at the yeah. airport. I want everybody in Atlanta there. The, uh, I want a special greeting when I get there. All right. We'll be back with Dion a little bit later. Let's now go back to Las Vegas. Of course, a couple of picks ago, Robert Massey was selected defensive back going to the New Orleans Saints. There was no question that the first defensive back chosen in this draft would be Deion Sanders. And the best thing about Neon Dion is that he gives our show at 7 p.m. on Sundays during football season a lot of pub. This is Deion Sanders, a.k.a. primetime, a.k.a. star athlete at just about anything. Graceful on the gridiron, crafty on the court. Debonair on the diamond, swift as the wind. There is nothing primetime cannot do. He may be the best athlete that I've ever been around as far as somebody who could be what we would call world class in a variety of different sports. Uh, he just, he's totally in a class by himself. Playground hoops is up his alley. Michael Jordan he may not be, but this he can do. And this he can do. There's no question the guy was the best athlete I've ever seen. I've never seen a kid that could run from home to first, home to third quicker than he. Along with his physical gifts, the competitiveness Sanders brings to every performance makes him hungry. I expect myself to be great in a, in a game of checkers. I expect myself to be great in a game of pool because I'm just the kind of competitor I am. I hate to be in second. And throughout his college years, second was not very often in his vocabulary. He and the Seminoles were tops in the College World Series. He qualified for the Olympic trials in his only season of competitive track. He received a nice invitation from his favorite ball club, $60,000 for a summer. But he's following the footsteps of Bo Jackson, playing baseball and football, and he hates the comparison. Bo Jackson plays football and baseball. He does well. Deion Sanders wants to play football and baseball and excel. And excel in lifestyle. The primetime signature. A fast life. White hat. Primetime shades. A look primetime hopes will catch on. Endorsing. People, everyone that wants to endorse Deion Sanders in primetime. I want to see that on sweatsuits, on shades, on hats, shoes, everything. I wouldn't mind that. I love to see little kids walk around here with prime time sweatsuits. And it's his antics on the field that may be what inspires little kids to be wearing prime time sweatshirts. He's flamboyant, cocky, brash. He makes sure everybody knows prime time is on the field. But prime time delivers, and he can't wait for his first NFL game. I have never seen a NFL football game. I have I've seen one on television, but I never have been to a game. And I'm looking forward to my first game, walking out on that field. I love to have all the fans yelling, prime time, prime time, prime time. And I'm back deep on the punt and just running all the way back or intercept the first pass thrown at me, run all the way back, 
turn to the crowd and throw my arms up and just take it all in. Deion Sanders will be prime time on Peachtree Street now as he's the top pick of the Atlanta Falcons. Uh, certainly will put some people into the stands. Uh, a team that uh, had some empty seats last year. However, will he play baseball? He's playing right now double A in Albany. Uh, there is a possibility that the New York Yankees might upgrade him to triple A in Columbus.